How's it going y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have a walk around video of this 2021 Can-Am Maverick Sport XXC. So the XXC is one of the upgraded Maverick Sport models. It's going to get the 64 inch wide suspension setup. So you're going to get the arched A-arms, have a ton of clearance. Uh, you're also going to get the uh, Fox Podium 2.5 piggyback shocks with QS3 adjustments rather than the 2.0s. Get a look at the shocks there. You are going to get 13.75 inches of travel front and rear with this setup. This package gets upgraded to 14 inch beadlock wheels. You are going to have the uh, Maxxis Bighorn 2.0 tires. You're going to have a 29 by 11 by 14 on the back and a 29 by 9 by 14 on the front. You also get the rear bumper on this machine will come standard. See there you do have a two inch receiver on the Maverick Sports as well. Bed capacity on the Maverick Sports is really good and you also have the deep walls so it kind of helps hold things in really well. Any Maverick Sport is going to come with the uh, fender flares already on it. You're also going to get the, uh, the nice doors already on it as well. So they are a full door, really nice latches on the outside and the inside see really good location really easy to open you also get the uh, gasket there so it's a uh, dust proof weather proof I should say dust resistant I mean you might still get some dust coming up through it but it's really nice I mean it keeps a lot of stuff out doesn't rattle going down the road just a super nice door set up before we move to the inside I will show you just the outside the color scheme it is the black and tan with the red Looks really good, um, just matte finish everywhere, so should be really resistant to scratching uh, with that painted plastic, and when it does get scratched, it shouldn't show it nearly as bad since it's a more dull finish, so I think it's really going to be a good one uh, for trail riding. It's going to look good for a long time. You are also going to get the uh, LED signature lights on this model. You'll see it is the 1000R, so this is the bigger engine. Uh, it would be a 100 horsepower naturally aspirated 1000 engine. Moving on to the inside, you are going to see that this machine does get the upgraded dash. So it's got the 7.6 inch digital display versus the uh, four and a half inch display that's in the uh, other models. Um, it's a really nice, good looking display that shows you a lot of information. Um, you can control it with this right here. You've got drive mode, so you can switch between sport and eco mode. Um, you can also get a readout for your um, RPMs, engine temperature, battery voltage, you can set your trip, an odometer, hour meter, all that. Um, this machine will come standard with Smart Lock as well. So Can-Am's um, newer locking front differential system. So basically you have a locked rear diff when you're in two wheel drive. When you click into that, that's gonna activate Smart Lock, which is a really smart limited slip. Uh, four-wheel drive system that uses sensors to check wheel speed and and determine when to lock up the front diff and when you go to smart lock you're going to activate your trail and your trail active so depending on which one that's in it will lock up the front diff a little bit faster depending on how fast you're spinning the front tires and if you choose to you can actually click that and manually lock in the front differential and it will stay locked until you click it to unlock it and then you're back into the smart four wheel drive and then back into two wheel drive right there. Um, on the left side, you just have the, um, the headlight switch. So no winch on this model, but you can add a winch for you know 350 to 450. Um, winches aren't too expensive. Storage is really good in the Maverick Sports. You do have a nice deep glove box there. Um, you've got a spot in front up here that's not huge, but honestly, it's a great place to throw your keys, your phone or whatever. Um, keep the keep the mud and the water off of them and lastly we'll uh, start this thing up because the Maverick Sports do sound really good not overly loud but just a nice throaty sound uh, they sound really good last thing I'll show you on the inside is going to be these seats so you do get the X package seats which have a little bit more grippy material uh, with the Can-Am red uh, color accents so they do look really good. Alright so that's going to do it for this walk around video of the 2021 Maverick Sport XXC. If you have any questions drop them in the comment section. Let us know what videos you'd like to see next. Until next time y'all have a good one.